Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome to another gameplay and today we are going to play full crit vein on the mid lane. Playing against Cassidy and he just got the kill. Alright, we're gonna use press the attack. And I have a good feeling about this game. Vayne is good against these champions. Alright, so we're gonna also end Q and press the attack. Look at that trait. Did he start with the shield? Not really. Oh, actually I wanted to also first. Remember you should also and then immediately Q. That way you can do it smoothly and just deal more damage within a short amount of time. I need my level 2 and I try out Hecarim maybe. Or is he scared? Oh, 3 HP dude, 3D. Come on, 3 HP. Just how close was that? Okay, I'm not gonna rush it. I can do this, look. And now I've got this. Like, I love playing with press the attack as Vayne. If you play aggressively early game, you can do so much damage. It doesn't even feel like late game champion, which you can do as much. Of course, some matchups are harder, like when you play against long range, lags on bot lane. And I usually go for boots first, but I can't afford them. I just go like this, more attack speed and some one hit damage, why not? Full crit Vayne is so fun, especially because of her Q, which has AD ratio, so... Your Q causes your next auto to deal more damage. It also has AP scaling. Yeah, like... I forgot about it. Maybe one day I play AP Vayne, but it's Shrawl. Let me know if you would like to see it. An enemy has been slain. An ally has been slain. You can help yourself in last hit in with Q, since it empowers your next auto and Hekka is fed. Gonna have to handle him like this, yeah. But everything's possible when you play Vayne. She has the outplay potential with Volt. Oh, I think he got lost in faults. And he's dead. We usually wanna apply Condemned last. Since it can apply Silver Bolts. So it's a finisher. Just make sure not to accidentally save your enemy by pushing away. I don't wanna overstay. Maybe Hekka will come. It's so early that I can't get a threat plating. I just back go now. So I could just get some extra speed without relying on boots. I usually don't recommend fighting the minion wave like this. I just wanted to poke him. And I can heal a bit while clearing minions. I think I don't need to ult right. Yeah. Outing just for extra AD is worth it sometimes, but not in this case. Out also improves your passive. The extra speed is tripled. Usually you wanna just save your ultimate for a team fight when you're actually being focused. Like I could save it for Hecarim during gank. And if you wanna 
pay yourself or reposition you need to queue for full duration because then you're just invisible. I actually have scary late game where I'm playing vain. So it's up to me. An enemy has been slain. Oh, he's getting tilted about this pick. An ally has been slain. For a moment I was like, is that Hekka, but it's just Ashi. Did he ping him? It seems like. I can zone from CS. It's just gonna last hit with Q. Yeah, check Dragon. I don't want to flash or something for 1-3, of course. All the damage already. He knows how it's gonna end, so already wants to back. I could go at Ash, maybe? Surprise! Oh! Not what I wanted. I wanted to auto before that. Yeah, I messed up. Sorry for that. I thought my auto was already going on. But it actually didn't fire and I Q, so I cancelled my ult so missed some damage. And I thought that Ash would still be there, I could have gone for Dragon before. Probably wouldn't stop Pekka from doing this Drake anyway. That would give me more time to poke him and that would be a shutdown. So yeah, I could have played this better. What I died. Wait, so you're already doing so much? Yeah, my bad, I could have killed Hekka and I shouldn't die to Kathleen like this. I actually don't recommend casting Q like this unless you wanna poke because that leaves you vulnerable.
Ah, he's maxing that slow. Almost. I think Hecker is around. And you can skip some part of animation of your Q, like this when you Q close to the wall. I survived at least for a moment I thought I can kill him. I just hope that my team won't surrender because we can definitely win that. Maybe at some point I will have to split push. I feel like I could be helping bot lane. Nice, I got Nami. She's gonna empower my old souls. Too late already with my turret. I took his before, it's alright. Vayne is not that mana hungry unless you spam E, but still could help. 1v1 I can probably kill Hacker already. And not like this, when there's Casa, come on. You know, usually I wouldn't go in like this, but I thought it's a really nice opportunity to finally shut him down. I think they're all blue strain. We're just gonna clear. Yeah. What were they expecting? Oh, it's one of those games where I will have to constantly split. Yeah. 
Now I do your death. I didn't out for nothing. Take him without ult. My mission is zero defects. I guess Kathleen's gonna have so much damage. is also unstoppable. And bot lane, I think them. I out for speed up in this case just to kill him because I could have killed him without out. But he flashed so it seems it was the right choice. Okay, power spike. Okay, good bait. Of rift. Why did we cast it like that? I need to show up here. They might engage seeing me on mid lane. Remember to save Q for a few fights. Ooh, that catch. Yay. Just took the right focus. That fight is game changing, I already had Infinity Edge, so no surprise. She do so much with three items. Maybe? He's not gonna face check. Aha! Surprise! No, Chogat. Way too much, even if I stayed. Okay, 
Okay, I should probably reach him. Uh oh. Uh, I thought he would immediately go in. Nah, I can't. I should have just stayed with Tim. Because they still fought Rekka and Lorda. I believe I can kill them faster. They're fine anyway. Trinity Force is great too. But then it will be full crit. I feel like going BT, that extra healing. Oh, it doesn't grant crit anymore, I forgot. You can now go full crit without. I've interviewed so many items, so yeah. I just reminded myself. An ally has been slain. I am no longer So I can just go Trinity Force last. BT will just help me against Kasadin. Or Morda. And try. That's why BT. Now I'm gonna heal. See? How much for Trinity? Okay. Oh no, blue buff. Let's go fetch more speed. Collector could be fun too. I just let them focus Shogat first. That was Ash Soul to me. This could be a nice bait.
Okay, let's go top. Now that's a really good build. Oh, you flash. There's so much speed because of Trinity Force as well. And there is extra heist too. During out your Q cooldown is also lower. Wait, I thought I ulted before, I didn't ult. I'm pretty sure I pressed ult key, so I don't know what happened. With ult I would just kill them all, I think. Anyway, you know what, let's go for full crit. Maybe with extra range. And I just get some healing from this elixir. And I can upgrade boots. They erased my past, but not my memories. Oh, Dragon Soul. Best group for that. I think BT with Trinity Force is stronger, but this should work too. Yeah. We'll just still wish them. actually focusing me from the start. Yeah, let's just go for Baron. I should have stayed with that build with BT and Trinity. Your team has destroyed a turret.
stabilized. So yeah, I'm not on. Like I need BT for real, I should have gotten that. Yeah, I'm getting that again. Okay, Chagat's gonna respawn. We are kind of trolling hard. It shouldn't happen. Shut down. And we need Chagat in our team fights. I mean, or the Kaiser out me just gave me some time to heal. But the focus was kind of hard. And it's always difficult when Haikai is just focusing me like this. So let's just wait for Elder. Now it's late game, anything can happen. We took a split pusher first. I go there alone, I guess. Just buying time for Elder. I'm not enough time, so I'm gonna try. Chagat has teleport. Yes, finally. I'm gonna stay with my team. That Ash, I just knew I had to switch focus. Another fight on the river that was key. 
to win this game. Mark, I thought he was not gonna stop me. I have BT again. Oh, it's an open nexus. Alright, GG. So we trolled a bit, but in the end, it was a good game. So thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed this. If you enjoyed, feel free to like and subscribe. Let me know what do you think. And you can check out my stream and my other channel in the description. If you got some champion requests, let me know. Thanks for watching and see you next time.